안녕하세요. 제 이름은 남입니다. Hi, it's Nami. It's been about five days since I've dyed my hair green, so I'm gonna go and wash it out and see how it washes out for the first time. Whoa. I don't know how much of a difference they'll be, but I'm also gonna use purple shampoo to try to get this hair a little bit more minty. So let's see how it turns. I'm excited. How do I do this without getting myself overly wet? Whatever, let's just get overly wet. I'm using the Vanilla No Yellow Shampoo. This one is pretty pigmented, so I still have a lot of this left. It feels pretty heavy. I think I used about this much so far, anywhere between three to six months. It gives a nice even coverage. So I'm just gonna take literally like a whole bunch. Can you even see how much? <gasps> oh my gosh. I'm gonna apply this throughout my little hair. I just like to do one pass to emulsify the shampoo just so I could get an even nice coat. Get a little bit more. The curse of the Butterfingers! And apply it more to the inside of my hair. It is a crime scene. Dun dun dun. <gasps> There's so much water on the crowd. I'll be back after conditioning, shampoo, not shampoo. This is how you know I just woke up. I'm like, I can't think straight. Condition, wash my face, wash my back. So see you later. The color looks a tad bit mintier. Let's see how it dries. After I washed it with shampoo and conditioner, I tried washing it again a second time with purple shampoo because I thought it would make it mintier, but instead it just made it silver. My roots are green, my ends are silver, slash bluish it looks kind of metallic this time i'm going to try washing it and then put in my green conditioner to redeposit some of the green color hopefully it'll turn a little bit more minty there's like so many colors going on no gloves <laughs> Why are you smiling? <laughs> this is weird. Do I look like a mermaid? Um, yes. Looks like a bath bath bomb is going off. Huh? <clears throat> it looks like a bath bomb is going off. A bath bomb? Bomb? Bath? Wait, what do you call it? The bath ball things that fizz into the water? I can't hear you. <laughs> oh. It's kind of going from a greenish blue to a blue to like a light blue. I like it. <laughs> What's so funny? Um, this is a nice color. It's a lot more rich. Mm. Mm. Ta-da! 
this is how it looks. I really like it. It's like a mix of green and blue. I don't want to take my hair down though because I have it in a nice tight bun. So I'm just going to show you like this. But in some areas you can see green and some areas you can see blue. In person it looks like it's blue with like a layer of green showing through. It looks blue initially and then if you turn it turns green a bit. So I really like how it looks right now. It makes me feel more like a mermaid. <laughs> this video was kind of random. I'm sorry how like random it came out. But I hope you enjoyed it. It was kind of interesting how like I wanted to make it kind of feel more raw. Like I'm washing my hair so I didn't really want to wear a full face. And also you are all y'all. <laughs> so nice all the time and thank you for your encouragements from my previous video with like almost the whole video of my bare face too i'm just about to head out so i will see you next time bye today we have a letter from margaret of maryland she wrote it so cute it says a letter for a beautiful person inside and out are you sure did you see that face just now? Dear Nami, my name is Margaret. I've been a subscriber for a while. My parents have been married 35 plus years. That's crazy. I have eight siblings and I'm 16 with no kids, lol. But I'm also a huge punk fan fan. I'm also a Christian, a Catholic to be more exact. That means I have pretty strict views on things like getting pregnant before marriage, but I have so, so, so much respect for what you have made from what could have been called a mistake. A very beautiful, loving family. Oh, heart, heart, heart. There's three hearts. I'm the youngest, so I'm the last kid at home, and I feel a bit like my parents have moved out of the parenting mode. Yeah, after eight kids. We have eight siblings. Yeah, after nine kids. I feel a bit like I'm a little forgotten. I'm also the youngest child, but I feel like it's the opposite for me. Like, my mom is overly protective, overly attached, and like overly parenting me. Like, oftentimes I just want her to leave me alone. I just really wanted to tell you that even if you don't realize it, you really mean a lot to so many people, even those who don't have a similar situation or experiences. I hope that you are doing well and that you continue to be happy and healthy. Keep doing what you're doing. Have a beautiful, fantastic day, Nami. Heart, heart, heart. Love and prayers, Margaret. Thank you, Margaret. I don't know, like, yeah, I feel like no matter how a parent will parent, because it's a relationship that's a two-way thing and with two parents it's like a three-way thing all of the time there's gonna be situations where no matter what the child is hurt in a certain way i feel like the main thing is balance like i really wish that as parents we could balance well too much of attention or too little of attention are both not good it must be hard for you it's hard being the youngest it's hard being the oldest it's hard being in the middle it's just hard life is hard life is hard everything's hard we just have to keep working hard in this hard life <laughs> but thank you for your encouragements and thank you for writing me this letter i'm always happy when i read your letters because i feel like sometimes it's different than comments and messages especially when i could see a bit of your personality through your writing or through your handwriting let's keep working hard every single day every single moment because life is hard so we gotta work hard or else we're gonna be crushed by this life <laughs> let's not be crushed and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see more, definitely make sure to subscribe and hit that bell notification to be notified right when new videos come out. That's usually the time that I do take to reply to your comments. I also post daily story posts on my Instagram and some photos here and there. So I'll check you out on these platforms if these are platforms that you use. And I'll see you next time. Bye!